Hi, welcome to Math Test Prep, where today we're going to answer a standardized math test question where we find the volume of a composite figure. We are asked to find the volume when we have a solid figure that is composed of a cube and a right triangular prism. The figure and some of its dimensions are shown in this diagram, and we're asked to find the volume of the figure. So the first thing we're going to do is identify that we have a right triangular prism, go to our math reference sheet that is given to us when we take a standardized test, and it says that the volume of a prism is capital B, or uppercase B, times H. This B represents the area of the base. In the instructions, we were told it's a triangular prism. So the area of a triangle from our formula sheet is one-half base times height times the height of the prism. Moving down, we have our cube making up our second figure in our composite figure, and using our math reference sheet, the volume of a cube is s cubed, which is side times side times side, because every dimension of a cube is the same. So let's go back, and we're going to do this in order, and we're going to identify that the, the base of our triangle is the same as our cube length, and it's 8. So we know that we can say that the area of this triangle is the base of 8 times the height of 6. Remember, base and height of a triangle must be perpendicular to each other. And this is a side length of the cube, which we know is 8. And then the height of a prism connects the two triangular faces, and we know that this side length is the same as the dimension of the cube, which is 8. So half of 8 is 4, 4 times 6 is 24, and then 24 times 8 gives us a volume for the triangular prism of 192. Moving on to our cube, we have 8 cubed, which is 8 times 8 times 8, or 512. And now we need to put the two volumes together. 192 plus 512 is 704, giving us an answer of B.